What up party people? As promised today, I am going to introduce you to Wondershare Uni Converter. This is a free software program. However, in order to insert the date and timestamps, you're going to need a paid for version. So here we are, Uni Converter. So you just simply Google Wondershare Uni Converter. Boom, there's your free download. It senses I'm on a Mac. If you're on a PC, it'll clearly pop that up as well. Um, simple little how-to, import your videos. These are the formats and all the fun stuff that it supports. It supports all of these functions right here from compressing to burning, subtitles, all that other fun stuff. Um, so let's go ahead and do this now. So we're gonna go ahead and open up UniConverter we're going to install and here we are here's our free version however I do recommend you purchase the Wondershare uni converter for whatever your machine is but definitely get the $69 plan let's go ahead and add that to cart we'll do our little PayPal I'm going to log in because I've got a PayPal account. So here you have it. Your email from Wondershare, you've already downloaded the software, you're paying for it. <clears throat> and this is your email. Let's go ahead and open up Uni Converter from Wondershare. Here we have, I guess we can call it. Um, Let's call it our dashboard for sake of not knowing what what they call it. Let's go ahead and import our video. Sadly, you will be able to import the MP4s and you can convert them and punch them in together. You can play with them, but you cannot import your date and timestamp on them. I don't know why, but for UniConverter, you need to change your cameras to shoot in AVCHD format. So you're going to find that in your SD cards under, you know, under private right here, AVCHD. Let's just drag the entire thing into the Wondershare. I'm going to go ahead and convert four clips for you. We're going to add that to the list. And now this is what we're looking at. You can see it's already adjusted to the quality that I'm shooting on 1920 by 1080 um, and the first steps I want you to do is go ahead and switch to high speed conversion let's turn that on and let's merge all of our files together right here output format is I prefer mp4 if you're shooting anything else 1920s totally fine we can go to 1920 um, or same as source res resolution is great. File location, we're at converted. And at this point, let's go ahead and enter our subtitles. That is gonna be our date and timestamp. So let's select HDMV PGS and just click out to the right. I don't know why they do it this way, but this is how they roll. HD blah 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 HD blah 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 and now we are ready to convert oh one last step what we ought to do is remove our audio so let's go ahead and select the little three dashes we're gonna go into our audio turn the volume all the way off apply to all are you sure you want to do that yes let's save it now all of our audio is off, our date and timestamps are on, let's convert. There you have it, our files are converted. Let's go ahead and look for our files. So if, if you can't figure it out, let's go to Wondershare. You're gonna see in the movies, down in converted, this is the file we just made. Let's go ahead and play that for you so you can see the quality playback. Here's your date and timestamp. It's all looking amazing. Fast forward, it's all looking great. The video is clean, clear, steady, date and time, no audio. 
So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. For those of you that didn't like the video, please like and subscribe. For those of you that still have some questions, and sadly I know the hardest thing about this product is probably registering it. I don't know why they made it so complicated, but they they just have, I did have a time where I did have to email tech support and they were super helpful and I got my product up and running the next day. So again, thank you for watching and subscribe.